rebound by Dantas. Jaden is uh, Odyssey Sims' little baby who is went through all the process of quarantine with Odyssey's mom. Demir's done because they brought in players that fit well together and who have been able to get going right away for this team. The young rookies to the free throw line. Bit of a quiet first half for her. Five points, four rebounds. Demaris hits the first for 18 points, 13 rebounds. The rebounds were career high. And then last Wednesday against Chicago, a career high. On the other end, Seattle Storm just doing consistently what they do so well is pounding the ball in down low. And two of the scores that Minnesota has really relied on, especially over the last three. Great lead for Seattle. Danger field to Collier and now Carlton. Carlton feeds a cutting Dantes. Because they double teamed on Stewart and Seattle did a great job of moving the ball, getting it over to Sue Bird, who's open. Bird's second three of the game. She has six points, five assists. Bannum kicks it out to Dantes. Demiris hits the three. It's a non-shooting foul. So it'll be Minnesota basketball on the side. Give and go, Sims to Dantes. Percentage of points that the starters had scored because the bench players have been in, had been in for a good chunk of that early fourth quarter. For a while, that's the starters were re representing over 80% of the points scored in this game for Seattle. Dun She's now at eight points and six assists. And Seattle has its starters in the game with 2.50 to go. Gary Kloppenberg likes that starting five to just make sure right. that the door gets closed against the Lynx. Well, he's done his uh, scout on this Minnesota Lynx team and